What is up, everybody? And welcome back for another Big Easy Bets College Basketball Play of the Day. It's Thursday, January 26, 2023, and we're feeling good. We called our shot last night, so we're getting back on track, and that's exactly what happened. A 2-0 sweep of the board. Houston, 9.5-point road favorites, and Xavier, 7-point road underdogs. Xavier gets the outright win against UConn, but a 2-0 sweep of the board. And we look ahead to tonight. 10 p.m. tip off. One play sticks out and one play only. It's a late one. Got to go out west. Arizona going on the road to take on Washington State. These two teams met about three weeks ago. Arizona was a 12 and a half point favorite on their home court. They ended up losing by 13. So when you dive into it, what went wrong? Washington State just had an uncharacteristically good shooting night. I'm talking I'm talking 43% from the three point line, 40% overall from the field. Their lone big man, Muhammad Gay, had the performance of his life 24 point double double. I don't think that we're going to see that again, if I'm being honest. Uh, statistics say we will not see that again, even though they are on their home court. You always hear me preach about conference road games. It's tough to go in conference on the road and come out with a win. Arizona is one of the elites in college basketball, in my opinion. Look, this is typically the time when the elites start to separate themselves from the middle of the pack. We're nearly to February. It's time to get rolling. I think we're going to see Arizona get rolling here. So we're back in the Wildcats, minus four and a half on the road. Uh, Balo and then Tabellis are the two guys you need to keep an eye on in this one. Their size, their length is going to be too much for Washington State. Balo kind of got exposed in this last matchup by Muhammad Gay. Gay got the better of him without question. I think you see Balo come out with a chip on his shoulder and uh, kind of prove a point here. I don't expect Gay to have a good performance in this one. His last time out, he was 0 of 7 from the floor, had zero points, so he's not exactly on a hot streak currently. Kirk Kreese has to play better, 36% from the field. We need more out of them. I think we see more out of them in this one. I think the Wildcats win this one and win big. So back Arizona minus four and a half. Let's try to make some money on a Thursday. Good luck.